We're here on Porchester Road in Mapley. As you can see, we are nestled away from the road itself, down some steps, which lead to this really nicely presented three bedroom, semi-detached house in traditional style. You've got a front garden here with established hydrangeas and shrubs with lawned area. As we come down, you'll see that there's a gate to the side elevation and a panel entrance door with courtesy light leads into an entrance porch where we have quarry tiled flooring and an opaque glazed panelled entrance door leading to the combination and the porch also has these two nice feature windows to either side. Coming into the hallway sets a really nice first impression of the property as you can see you've got a good sized window to the side, stairs with open balustrade leading to the first floor. Directly ahead of us is a panelled door to the kitchen, there's some understair storage cupboards and this door leads into the dining room. Dining room is characterised by this really nice bay window to the front elevation. There is a period style fireplace set within the chimney rest. And as you can see, there's space for a good sized dining table and also a seating area as well. And there's coving to the ceiling. Let's go and have a look in the kitchen. You've got a range of base and down level units with work surfaces to three elevations providing some good food preparation space. There's a stainless steel sink and drain unit with mixer taps set beneath the window, which offers us our first glimpse of the rear garden. There's space for a gas cooker and space for a stack fridge freezer. We've got tile finished vinyl flooring, a window to the side elevation and a part glazed timber panel door. Panel door to the left here leads through to the lounge. Lounge again, Really nice size. You've got patio doors overlooking and leading to the rear garden. And there's a period style fireplace that sets a chimney rest with tiled hearth once again. Coming outside to the garden, as you can see there's steps leading down to the main garden area, which is predominantly lawn with a central pathway. You've got a little paved patio area here, which takes advantage of the morning sunlight. You've got outside power and outside tap. You've got an abundance of shrubs set to borders and as we run through the garden space you get to a further patio area to the rear of the garden with space for a garden shed and we're enclosed by timber fencing and hedgerow. Another little seating area there with raised border which is a lovely feature. Let's go back inside and we can go and have a look at the first floor accommodation. Going back through the lounge As we ascend the stairs to the first floor, you'll notice there's a balustrade return to the left-hand side and a good-sized window to the side elevation. From here, there's panel doors to all three bedrooms and the bathroom. Bedroom one is to the front elevation. Nice size space, this. As you can see, plenty of space for bedroom furniture. This too has a bay window to the front elevation. As you can see, you get a good view here of the outlook. Bedroom two is a further door bedroom, this being to the rear. Fitted wardrobe to one of the uh, chimney rest recesses. Extends into a desk to the right hand side. And from here you get a fantastic view over the local area, which does need to be viewed to be appreciated. But good sized double bedroom this as well. Bedroom three is a single bedroom to the front elevation with overstair storage. Finally, the bathroom. You've got a panel bath with electric shower and this full height tiling with decorative inserts and border, pedestal wash basin WC, tile finished vinyl flooring and a paint glazed window to the rear. You've got a radiator here and you also have a storage cupboard which houses the central heating tank. So all in all, really nice sized property. Conveniently situated for access to both Mapley and the city centre. You've got gas central heating and double glazing throughout. These stunning views to the rear, nicely finished with a private rear garden.